hey guys welcome back to my channel so in today's video we are going to see a brand new power bi dashboard and in front of your screen you can see this will be the final output which we will be designing and the topic of our today's uh, discussion is sales overview dashboard by region so in front of your screen you can see there are many advanced things which we have used many new color combinations many uh, i can say a new type of background a professional background which we have used in this particular video all right so this dashboard is completely dynamic guys uh, you know uh, by operating few filters few sizers you will be able to you know modify this particular entire dashboard and you will be able to see the different values all right right so i will just give you an overview of uh, you know uh, what all elements are being used in this particular dashboard what are the different calculations what are the different functions that we are going to see in this entire dashboard so at the top you can see there is a date range available for us uh, which specifies and gives us the date range which is available in our data set and in the left hand side you can see there is a placeholder which is created for each region so this gives us the central region where we are finding out the cells and this is the sales value and with respect to that we have found out here a spark line we can say it is a bar spark line where we are having from january to december how the trend of sales is there and from which we can analyze which are the most important months with highest sales and the lowest sales and based on that also we have plotted one uh, average line of all these months so this we will be seeing entirely in this particular video and here we have shown the previous year sales all right so now this dashboard isn't a static one here it is representing a sales value for us so let's say if you want to see it for profit okay so you want to analyze a a totally different major so when i click on profit you can see this is entirely showing us the values for profit if you want to see quantity wise it will give us the entire results for quantity wise getting or not so the same it is completely dynamic if you want to see it for a different year so right now it is 2024 if you want to see for 2023 it will give us the data for 2023 if you want to see for 2022 it will give us the result with respect to that getting or not so the same we have analyzed for east region we have sales and then we have its value and its previous sales and if you can see for each of the region we have set and we have given a different color combinations uh, so a, a complete central region will be given this color east region is with this color sales uh, then the south is with this and the west is with this color so you can use the different colors whichever you want i thought this was helpful and this looked good for my per dashboard so i have used this particular getting or not so uh this was all a kpi we can say with spark lines and with uh, previous year values and already uh, uh, you all know that the if you have to find out something related to last year last month or if you are finding trailing 12 months rolling 12 months we have to use uh, time intelligent functions uh, tax calculations so in this you will be learning those advanced calculations as well i will show you how what calculations we have used in a minute all right so then we have a sales by state so this is a bubble chart for united states so higher the bubble size higher is the state or which is having with maximum sales profit or quantity whichever we are selecting in our filter all right so uh based on that if you can see you have we have already given a different color so this this is a south uh, we can say a west region for us this is a central this is our uh, eastern region and at the bottom it is what our southern region so based on that the same color combinations we are following so this gives us the visual representation at one glance we can see how is the distribution of sales profit and quantity uh with respect to the size of bubbles uh, you can conclude or you can take an insight that how many what are the sales in those particular areas getting on so uh, this is this is what we are we are we are analyzing and and with the same i have also kept here a bar chart which will give you and more view or instead of looking over here you want what is exactly which is the highest selling country or with sales and profit you can see california new york this is a, in fact a, a chart with uh, descending orders right so this is how you can analyze from here also if you hover over your mouse you can see the sales value also from which uh, what is the name of the state and uh, obviously from which region it comes and the same color combinations are being used here as well and obviously uh, these filters are valid here as well if you want to see profit you can see profits as well if you want to see quantities as well right 
so based on whatever you want you can see those so before moving ahead into our this project i would like you to introduce to my website so this website i have created with request of many subscribers and followers where they want or they are they always ask me to provide the different projects different materials a proper roadmap with all the links in that so we they can follow and they can become a perfect data analyst so in this particular website there are so many projects so many uh, uh projects in different tools and so materials of different tools i have added it over here and right now here you can see i have a complete data analyst complete material power by projects are there but you might be confused like what will be exactly available in this material so you just have to click on this particular material and when you click everything is given over here right so you can just read everything out and you can check what is exactly available in this material and based on that only you can go ahead and purchase it right similarly for projects also when i click on this particular projects you can just see sample projects how it will be looking like and you can see what are the projects available on which particular domain this particular projects are available what are the name of projects everything is been provided over here so likewise i have data analyst complete material in which all the tools are covered you will get all the notes uh, you know you will get all the cheat sheets ppts which you can just refer before going to an interview there are scenario based interview questions hr manager level 1 level 2 level 3 interview questions and answers scenario based interview questions and answers uh, you have uh, links to uh, you know to uh, or we can say a proper syllabus is there and what links you should follow to complete those particular syllabus right so entire road map is present projects are there if you want to go for any specific material you don't want to purchase all the material you can just go with this materials excel projects are there tableau projects are there tableau material blinkit analysis which i uh, which i did you on uh, already on youtube that is present and if you want to connect it to a one on one then there are career options calls also available mock interview options are also available right so i would i would recommend you to go ahead and check this out and right now the shera festival is going on and i used to update the sales on my youtube channel also uh, what sales are been what discounts are been going on right now 53% off is there and i guess this is valid only for today in future also there will be sales coming but um, you can just go ahead come to this highlight option and you can see what code you have to use and it is valid up to what date okay i usually used to upload it on my community post on youtube and on linkedin profile as well all right so uh, if you are interested you can go ahead you can see uh, if it is helping you you can go ahead and find this and if you can see this my 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 profile is verified from topmate okay and i was a top rated in 2023 top rated in data as well so this all materials are created by myself my own because i am the sole owner of this particular website as well as on my channel so please go ahead and check it out and now we will move ahead with our video then we have also analyzed a grid view over here or a matrix view which gives us the comparison of current year matrix and previous year matrix for all the regions so here you have regions then we have shown your current year sales previous year sales okay what are the current year sales what are the previous year sales and when i say current year sales it represents whatever us year i am selecting over here right so let's say if i have selected 2024 current year for me will be 2024 previous year will be 2023 so let's say i select 2023 now so for me now current year is 2023 and previous year will be one year back i can say from 2023 one year back it will be 2022 obviously the names are confusing uh, we can we can give some different names also but i thought this would be helpful because it is easy to understand you can use some other nomenclatures as well so based on that we have here year on year sales as well i will go 2024 so year on year sales is nothing but with respect to last year what are the sales for current year right so what was the growth of that sales with respect to uh, previous year for current year so this is the percentage value you see and if the percentage values are positive that is nothing but if it is increasing with respect to last year you will see an upward uh, you know a mark over here and if you can see here is 0% it is not actually 0% it might be 0.56 but we are converting rounding it out to one decimal point so it is 0% and it is decreasing right in the same way we have analyzed this for sales the same way we are we will be analyzing it for current year profit as well 
and we have previous year profit year on year profit and same for other metrics as well and in this we are not only going to see the entire dashboarding we will be seeing some data uh you know quality checks and all those things we are also seeing here uh, we are going to see a modeling also so this is the data modeling as well in this we will be also cal uh, finding out the calendar table so we are using a calendar tables as well and we will be finding out the calendars as well right so we are going to use a date table i can say or we call it as a calendar table also so i'll show you a few calculations some custom calculations which you are going to use see let's say for current year sales okay so you can see for current year sales uh, we are going to use this kind of uh, dax calculations so uh, we are also going to use uh, say uh, the sales for previous year okay so this this is the sales for previous year how we are formatting this right so entire dax advanced dax you can see which we are going to use in this particular uh you know uh, entire uh, project i will show you how we have written why we have written all this so let's say if you want to see for year on year sales okay so these are the year on year sales how we are using why we are using actually this formattings for up arrow what is unique care what is is number and all those things everything we are going to see uh, so these are few then we have also going to see parameters here because you have we are using a parameter to dynamically change the metrics for different sales and profits whatever we have to visualize so we are going to use some parameters as well and mainly we are going to use uh, a dex functions or you know uh, time intelligence functions which are widely used in power bi we are going to use some filter functions we are going to use some text functions as well all this we are going to use we are going to use for some how to select the titles as well and all those okay so different different functions we are going to use in this particular project so uh, i hope uh, you will be learning so many things from this video and i would request you to please uh, be updated on my channel give it a thumbs up if you are uh, if you if you want to learn this project i will be creating a video soon on this and i will be uploading it uh, next monday uh, i guess on 28 uh, the video will be live with, live with full uh fledged development of two or two and a half hours and you can follow up and you can do and meanwhile uh if, if you have any data you can use this particular design in your project uh, uh which looks cool uh, which will be attractive and which which provides you multiple insights in this from this particular video all right so i hope you like this particular project and you will show some love to this particular video uh, uh just go ahead and subscribe the channel like the video turn on the notification bell so that you will get an uh you know notification whenever i am uploading new project search uh like this and uh, uh just comment out if you want some projects on any topics or all else right so thank you guys see you in the next one